states screw up. It's a live broadcast, and one of their video channels is off, not working. That's the channel that is supposed to show us, the public, what the astronauts are seeing in virtual reality. Also, the channel shut off is the masking for the guy on the wires in the background. You can't make this stuff up. Just watch. We all know NASA uses wires, and sometimes we'll catch them like this here, the guy pulled on his wire. However, some days when you're filming live, things just don't work out, and it becomes so blatantly obvious, it's ridiculous. So, in this clip, they're talking, live feed, and what you know, we have a astronaut go by us in the background, uh, obviously trying to give it a more realistic, spacey, station, busy effect. The only problem is the camera that was supposed to mask this harness out or the uh, video feed is not working. And so we see the guy come flying along in a harness on his wires. Pretty amazing. But that's not all that goes wrong here. Okay, so you see to the right, this guy's flipping this hat. This hat's actually on another video um, channel in 3D space. It's virtual reality. He's, they're wearing augmented uh, contact lenses so that they can interact with these 3D objects. Now, in this scene, the guy on the left in the green shirt, he thinks he sees an object in 3D space that's being broadcast to him. So he grabs it and he puts it off to the side. He's looking straight ahead because he's looking at an object rotating in front of him, but the video channel is down that is supposed to show the viewers what we're supposed to see, and so we don't actually get to see the object that he has seen. And I would just sum this up as a very terrible, bad, horrible day for NASA doing live feeds. Oh, oh, hey, Tim. Tim, you still there? Yeah. Um, can you explain to us what this astronaut's going through as he sees something with his eyes in 3D space, but it's not actually there being broadcast to the public? What, what's going through this astronaut's mind? The system is sending signals to the brain um, that don't, doesn't really match your eyes, and so your brain's trying to work out the two differences. Here's the thing. Uh, as much fun as this was, there is a time coming when you and I will not be able to tell the difference. And space has not changed. Uh, technology to fake space has gotten better. Just because Adobe gets a massive update to Photoshop or After Effects, or there's a massive update at Telemetrics and their virtual reality, augmented virtual reality programming, that does not advance us magically 20 years in space. Space has not changed. It's flat. It's above us. It's dimensional, and we cannot orbit Earth. You have been warned. Um, this is very serious stuff, and if you do not get it now, you won't get it later, because later you won't know the difference.